Hi, so this is the, the second video on Tian Gun. So if you want to just understand about the exercises and their purpose, have a look at my first video. What we're going to be doing here is looking at exercises 6 through to 10. Okay, um, just very briefly just to recap that what is important with these exercises is that you feel the um, you're rooted, so you're into the into you're sinking into the ground. Okay, um, you feel your because of your stance, whatever foot you're pressing into the ground is allowing you to rotate your waist. Okay, um, and then the waist is moving your hands. You try not to move your arms by themselves, but you feel it come from the ground out. So it starts to teach coordination from the ground through to the waist out to your hands. Okay, um, and this is the idea of these exercises to teach power. So number six is what we would call reverse camping. Okay, so what we do with this exercise here is that I, and it's a twisting type of movement here. Don't over twist, keep it in structure, twist, and as we twist in here, it comes over the top. Twist, over the top, twist, over the top, twist, and then as it comes over, it untwists and clamps. Other <coughs> side, twist, clamp. See, I twist and I keep my, I don't close my gua off. I open, I twist, and it comes up. Okay. Next one is circle block and back fist. A very similar block, uh, low movement as what we just did. But now from here, we don't break the structure. We from here use a body vibration to pull the shoulder. Next one is um, crane's beak or crane's beak. What we're going to do from here is as we come over here, um, one's going to drop down and one's going to raise up. So one, one drops, one raises. So you have a dropping energy and a raising energy together. A drop and a raise. Again, these aren't applications, they're developing certain types of power, okay? That's a very similar movement or training method as what you'll see in Wing Chun with Naf Sao and Dan Sao after the, those who know Wing Chun, Silom Tao, after the Jim Sao, Jit Sao, Bu Sao, Nat Sao, Dan Sao, okay? Very similar movements, we're just doing the opposites. Next one is wave hands. From this exercise here, you're going to turn and you see the structure of the hands that I'm not just moving my hands, that it's my waist that's moving and see how the circle is turning the arms turn and rotate from the shoulders okay this type of idea here is um, actually one of the shingy animals top some people call water lizard or alligator okay some stars of shingy use that um, next one then is low block turn and thrust okay um, the posture very typical of Bagua, a lot of people will recognize it. Um, so from here, I sink. As I sink, I'm, I feel like a rounding, pressing out. Okay. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to set my stance up, so this foot will come in. I'll sink the weight on the back foot. I change here, and then thrust. Sink, thrust. Sink, thrust. Sink, thrust. Sink, thrust. Sink. Um, this actually makes use of um, your learning here to use your weight, um, but then you also have what we'd call um, body shift. Okay, you can use body whip or you can use body shift. Those who know Bagua, uh, start of the form. We start off, we come down, up, or we come into position. Okay, so this is very typical. Um, what, uh, white uh, monkey offers fruit, when, when we, we step around, similar type of movement, one, two, okay, that body, body whip, body thrust, so um, it's a very similar type of movement, but just single hand, okay, so again, these are just exercises to, to learn how to develop power, um, I'm showing them very um, relaxed at the, at the moment, um, so there's different ways you can practice them, you can practice them slow and fast, so I can practice wave hands,
just feeling the connection, okay, <coughs> or I can start to use a lot more power with the movement. So I can go here and I can just go, just feel my own body timing with the technique. Or <coughs> start to try and issue a little bit of power. Many different ways of practicing it. So, next video we will do um, next movements up to 15. Thank you.